Hello everyone, I am Dr. Asmatullah and today we will watch a case of intumescent cataract with the intraocular pressure of 34 mm of mercury. This was a 97 years old man who was suffering from bilateral intumescent cataract. We did the left eye first. Tri-pen blue dye has been injected into the interior chamber. Surgeon is trying to remove the air bubble. In intumescent cataract, the capsule rex is a very difficult job. But good luck for the surgeon. He is using cystitome trying to give a nick into the interior capsule oh, it's intumescent white fluid came out of the bag almost all the cortical matter has been liquefied now the best step is to suck all the liquefied cortical matter through a Simcoe cannula and decrease the pressure in the bag surgeon is doing the same putting some more viscoelastic into the interior chamber to fill up the bag Now he is trying to make a capsular access with the CST tome. Going well. Up till now, surgeon is doing very well. There is no interior capsular fibrosis. This is a good sign. As there is no cortical matter in the bag and the nucleus is very small, it's almost empty. Surgeon is in a very difficult spot. I think he should try capsular access forceps after that at, as the cystotome is not helping him out. Let's see what happened to the interior capsule. We bring the interior chamber IOL also because there was a phacodenesis in the left eye and we were not sure that the posterior chamber IOL will stay. The zanules were very weak. Putting some more viscoelastic into the interior chamber. Very well. He heard me. He is going for the capsule rexus forcep now. I hope he will succeed. Pulling the flap medially unable to grab the interior capsule yeah he's doing very well look at the bag it's almost empty look at it very well he's doing very well up till now almost 70 percent capsule rexes has been done he is struggling with the interior capsule. Oh, it's... It's went too far, I think. Now what will he do? 
I think he should remove the nucleus and then decide for the IOL. Putting some more viscoelastic to deepen the interior chamber. Look at the nucleus, it's very small. 3.2 knife extend into the wound and this is the conventional extra capsule cataract extraction now it is obsolete but sometime we do it in a special cases putting this i think he is doing visco expression putting visco elastic into the oh it came out it's so tiny <clears throat> best luck for the patient if he has some good vision he was peel positive in both eyes cutting the interior capsular tag with the vana scissor now it's time for the iur implantation thank god there is no need for the aciol <coughs> dialing the lens into the sulcus very nice Let's put the lens and uh, it's almost in the center placed horizontally the quality of video was very ni not very nice so I increase the con contrast and brightness of the video so the view sh is clear now three sutures was placed by a junior surgeon and the case was done very nicely hope he will have a good life thank you